Hi there, this is Marty from OwingsArt.com. That's O-W-I-N-G-S-A-R-T.com. And today we're going to take a look at these Le Pen markers from the Marvi Company, uh, also known as Uchida in Japan, made in Japan. Um, Uchida of America produces uh, these pens or um, imports these pens from the manufacturing facility in Japan. What uh, differentiates these pens, pens uh, these markers from some others is probably their thin body style. They have a very narrow barrel, very thin barrel, so they're great for small hands or kids. But these are quite good quality um, art markers. Now, I was really interested reading the their um, tagline or marketing on the front of the packaging. I'm just going to read it out loud. It's kind of funny. It says, when speaking of greatness, there can be no comparisons Marvy Le Pen has no rivals with its unique micro-fine point and sleek, elegant, and lightweight barrel design. <laughs> I don't know if they, uh, you know, it's good to have a healthy ego and lots of confidence in, <laughs> in your art supplies. And uh, the Marvy company certainly has that in this Le Pen. So we'll give them a try. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to test out each uh, pen individually. And then I'll do a little, I'm just going to use probably the wrong uh, blender to try to blend these, but I'm going to use a, a, an alcohol-based blender to blend these, and then we'll see what that looks like. And uh, after that, I'll demonstrate a little drawing with these. So right now, I'm just applying uh, ink to paper just to see how it flows and looks. And it, it's quite bright and vivid, and the ink comes out nice out of the end of the pen. And you can tell that the tips are pretty high quality because there's not any bending or degradation and I press kind of hard. Um, this set is interesting because it comes with with two black markers or yeah two black markers uh, a blue, uh, a red, a green, uh, a lighter red almost an orange and then a pink, a burgundy, a teal and a lavender. So it's, it's a 10 pen set, but it comes with two black pens, which is interesting because um, most of their other sets, you just get one black pen. And I think they give you that black pen because um, they consider these writing instruments as well, which, you know, that makes sense since it's a pen. So here I'm just going to do a little lettering and some artwork. Right, now. I thought it was worthwhile to rewrite their... Uh, the propaganda that they put on the front of their packaging here and because uh, I think it's pretty it's ballsy to put that on the front of your package that you say we have no rivals and when you're speaking of greatness there's no comparison I just kind of think that was pretty awesome um, and uh, you know unlike the Japanese who are you know tend to be uh, value modesty so I don't know if something got lost in the translation there or what, but the bottom line is, in my test, these pens are, are pretty excellent. I mean, I don't know if they match the rhetoric, but they do a good job, and, um, it, you know, you can see for yourself, they seem to be pretty good. Uh, here I'm just going to sketch out the pen itself, not using any rulers or anything, just, just going to sketch things out and um, yeah, do kind of do a little drawing of the pen itself. So what I found was, you know, basically the, the ink goes down smoothly. The tips are, are quite hard and they're nice. I mean, you can tell they're not going to bend or flex too much. Um, I had no trouble with ink flow, even on softer, the softer paper. Um, even when, you know, cross hatching or going in quite deep into the paper, I didn't find any, like, uh, I wasn't, it wasn't so sharp on the tip that it was scraping up the paper like some pens will do. And the ink just came out really nice. So, yeah, I think these are great pens. And, um, yeah, no complaints at all. This 10-piece basic set, uh, I think, landed me, I don't know, like 12 bucks or something like that. It's not, not very expensive at all. And, you know, the Japanese do a good job with quality control. I really like the products that come out of Japan for the most part. So don't forget to leave a comment or question if you have one about these particular pens or, um, or you have some experiences with them. I'd love to hear from you. Um, and if you haven't done so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Well, thanks for dropping by and checking uh, this video out today of the 
uh, Le Pen by Marvy Company or Uchida, uh, uh, made in Japan. Um, really great pens, and I do recommend them. All right, thanks everybody. It's all on for now.